Karachi is a small farmer's region. It's a very special place. It suffered the brunt of the armed conflict for a long time in Colombia. Most of the people did not want to even come close to Chuachi. But it turns out that it's been 10 or 12 years since the conflict has receded from the area. And Chuachi has a potential like no other. My name is Alexandra Posada. I'm 35 years old and I'm building the first house made out of tires in Colombia. Tires take between 10 to 20,000 years to decompose and that becomes a huge problem. There is no way to recycle tires without using an extreme amount of energy. To shred a tire takes up an, a lot of energy. I decided that I'd rather make a house that would set some sort of example that would inspire people to maybe build better. You're using a material that you recycle. And it's not only tires, it's using the glass bottles, recycled glass bottles in the rooftops and you have more indirect light. It's using uh, demolition materials that would other be, otherwise be thrown away. So in, in these houses we're building, we've recycled around 9,000 tires. We've recycled more than 20,000 glass bottles. We've recycled more than 2,000 plastic bottle bricks, which is a plastic bottle which you fill up with non-organic trash. So it becomes a, also another building block. And for every other element of the house, that's also what we're looking for. So all the, all the floors of the house where we've used brick are actually second-hand bricks from demolitions in Bogota. We have a big problem in terms of huge neighborhoods built on the sides of the mountains. Every time it rains, most of the houses just fall or start to crumble. If we build retaining walls out of tires, you use the same earth that you need to take out from the side of the mountain to fill up the tires, and that's it. De repente eh, nos enteramos que había una colombiana que estaba trayendo una, unos empresarios estadounidenses que trabajaban eh, con llantas para construir casa. Y entonces, pues la verdad es que con tantas ganas de participar en un proyecto de esos y de repente nos encontramos con que estaba aquí en Colombia, inmediatamente sin pensarlo nos fuimos de voluntarios. Entonces, eh, pues tuve esa oportunidad y gracias a eso comenzamos a planear para hacer nuestras construcciones propias y pues la idea, digamos, es ya irnos a construir la gran aula de reciclaje que es nuestro sueño. Seven million discarded tires in just Colombia. It's it's limitless what you could do with them. You could do retaining walls side by side through all the roads that they're building throughout the country. You could transform entire neighborhoods. You could work person by person and build, helping someone build their dream home. The idea is for this to replicate. Alexandra Posada uses a technique known as Earthship Biotexture to build the homes. They're considered the ultimate in green buildings. There are seminars and training sessions to teach this technique worldwide. We'd love to have your input, so if you know someone who's helping change the world, drop us a line at an at cctv-america.com or tweet us at cctv underscore America. 
and tell us about a game changer you would like to see on America's Now. America's Now.